to Miles Tails Prowl Reads, Chapter 8 of The Raven and the Robin. I'm Tails. Now let's continue where we left off. You want a piece of me, Titans? Well, come and get it. Slay began to charge at the Titans. Titans, go! Robin shouted as the Titans started a fight with Slade after the fight lasted after the fight lasted for a few minutes. Robin was knocked down by Slade. You think you're tough, Robin? Slade asked as he grabbed Robin by the throat. You and your friends think you can stop me? Well, you're wrong at that. Raven was in Slade was interrupted by Starfire using her powers and pushed Slade away from Robin. The fight went on more and the Titans kept on and the Titans kept on fighting. You'll never win, Slade, Robin said as he pushed Slade off the edge, off of the edge of his lair, where he fell down a floor down the stairs. Slade's neck snapped, and the Titans heard that Slade broke his neck. We did it! I can't believe we did it! Starfire smiled. Suddenly, Overlord, Cinderblock, and Plasmus all appeared from their cells. We may have taken Slade down, but you still gotta take us down. Overload, along with Cinderblock and Plasmus, began to attack the Titans with Starfire and Robin, who were both out of sight looking at each other. We can take Slade's lair down by sending it all on fire, Starfire said at the plan of Robin. He was impressed by Starfire's idea. I love the idea. Robin reached for his communicator. Titans, Starfire and I have a plan, that, and we'll and we'll get to and we'll work for sure. Well, tell us and make it quick. These guys are not going to run down easily. Tara said through the communicator. We're gonna set Slade's lair on fire, and when it's set on fire, and we set it on fire, all of us need to get out. Robin replied. He and Starfire both snuck into the boiler room. It made it explode by messing the values around and done other stuff that is explosive. The Titans all got out of Slade's lair as the flames burst out of the explosion. The Titans were at a far distance watching Slade's lair destroyed. We did it, Starfire said to her friends. Cyborg, is she okay? Ramen turned to see Raven, still not awakened yet. I'm sorry, Ramen. I've... Cyborg was cut off by Robin Salmon while he held Raven in his arms. Raven, I'm so sorry. I've messed up a lot. You mean a lot to me, Raven. I've cared about you so much. I've always had. Robin kissed Raven's forehead as his lover woke up and looked at Robin. Robin? Raven asked weakly. Raven! Both smile. Robin smiled happily as he knew that his lover was alive and okay. We have destroyed Slade. He won't come for us anymore, Raven replied as Starfire hugged her best friend and began to cry. Don't cry, Star, Raven said to her best friend. She's been through a lot. It's been a rough night, Tara replied. Tara replied as the Titans all nodded in agreement to go back to the tower. And that was chapter 8 of The Raven and the Robin, the original Teen Titans fan fiction written by the Shadow Lioness. What do I think of it? In all honesty, I actually find this to be really good. I actually find this to be epic. I actually love the fight between the Titans and the Slade, and Slade, as well as his minions. Paragraph structuring was nice, Sentence structuring is A-OK, -okay, in a good way. Now, I actually like that Slade and the, and the Titans sung Ready As Ever Be from Tangled, the series. Now, I have heard of this once or twice, but I kind of forgot how, how it goes. So, sorry about that. <laughs> I guess you could say that, it, that that is kind of a blind reaction. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Anyway, yeah, overall, I love this chapter. Now, what do you guys think of this chapter? Do you like it or did you not? Feel free to let me know in the comment section down below. 
And are you enjoying this story so far? Or are you not enjoying it? Don't forget to let me know in the comment section down below. Well, I better get back to my inventions. I have a lot of stuff to work on, especially with helping Sonic and our friends take down Eggman. But thank you all very, very much for watching. This is Miles Brower, a.k.a. Tails, signing off. See you later.